2020 Mercedes GLC facelift, 2020 Mercedes GLC 300, into Maybach territory, almost. Welcome to our car blog, this time we will be share information about the latest cars is coming Mercedes brand. The title of the article we take is 2020 Mercedes GLC facelift, 2020 Mercedes GLC 300, into Maybach territory, almost. We will be try discuss details about this car, ranging from, reviews, concept, redesign, rumors, exterior, interior, specs, changes, engine, colors, pictures, release date and also prices. Congratulations to read and we hope you enjoy it and then we'll come back again here. 2020 Mercedes GLC facelift, 2020 Mercedes GLC 300, into Maybach territory, almost, the 2020 Mercedes-Benz GLC class gets a big tech upgrade inside. The 2020 Mercedes-Benz GLC class that goes on sale by the end of 2019 is something of a companion crossover SUV. The refreshed GLC adds the automaker's latest infotainment software and screens, which means occupants can say, hey, Mercedes followed by a command such as where's the nearest Starbucks, or will the sun be shining in Miami tomorrow. Otherwise, the 2020 GLC features a new, more powerful turbo 4 base engine. Additionally, a newly available adaptive cruise control that can automatically slow the vehicle based on the posted limit. Two versions of the GLC are available, a conventional crossover SUV and a model Mercedes calls the GLC Coupe that has a sloping roofline that adds style and subtracts cargo utility. The new GLC 300 S 2.0 liter turbo 4 is rated at 255 horsepower and 273 pound-feet of torque, an increase of 14 HP over last year's model. Power goes to either the rear or, optionally, all four wheels via a 9-speed automatic transmission. The GLC Coupe is equipped with standard all-wheel drive. Mercedes has not said if fuel economy will change from last year's 24 mpg combined rating for the GLC 300. Mercedes has not said if the GLC 350e plug-in hybrid will return for 2020. Steel springs and 18-inch alloy wheels come standard on the GLC 300, while an air suspension and upsized wheels are optional. An optional off-road package includes modified traction control settings and additional underbody protection for the handful of GLCs that will intentionally venture away from pavement. The GLC's dimensions are largely unchanged over last year. Updated styling on all versions includes new bumpers, LED headlights, and revised wheel designs. The compact crossover SUV squares off against rivals such as the BMW X3 X4 and Audi Q5 with its 113.1-inch wheelbase and 183.3-inch overall length regardless of body style. 2020 Mercedes-Benz GLC Class Safety and Features The GLC's interior is largely unchanged but now features a standard 10.3-inch touchscreen for a new infotainment system that Mercedes has been rolling out on its vehicles. Apple CarPlay and Android Auto compatibility is standard, too. The new infotainment interface has a touchpad and a touchscreen, and features voice recognition that can search the internet. The 2020 GLC comes standard with heated front seats that are power adjustable with memory for the driver, a power liftgate, and blind spot monitors. The options list includes a configurable 12.3-inch screen that replaces the conventional analog gauge cluster, leather upholstery, cooled front seats, Burmester audio, and a panoramic moonroof. On the safety front, the GLC comes standard with automatic emergency braking and a driver attention monitor. The available adaptive cruise control now automatically adjusts the GLC speed to the posted limit and can automatically change lanes at a tap of the turn signal if it senses an opening in traffic. Mercedes has not said how much the 2020 GLC will cost when it goes on sale by the end of this year, but it's not likely to move far from the $42,000 it charges for the 2019 model. Thanks.